Stanton Indian Shelter. It's a great shelter, great site. Uh, rained on us last night for, uh, I don't know, about seven or eight hours. So kind of wet this morning. Uh, all the gear was dry. Let's see if I can get around here and see standing Indian in the background there. That doesn't look so imposing. I uh, got 1.6 to the summit. Uh, it's a great trail on the way up here. Got really good rest last night, really good recovery. Uh, excited to uh, hit the trail this morning. It's, uh, it's Saturday, it's the weekend, so I'm out for a weekend hike. Um, not much else to add. Uh, Finnegan Fast Freddy stayed here last night and uh, Lost Boy and uh, had the two best guitarists on the Appalachian Trail and no guitar. That was depressing. Um, and then uh, Nor'easter came rolling in sometime about 9 a.m. He's from Maine and uh, you know it was uh, if he's awake everybody else needs to be awake but it was it was too funny. He pitched his tent and uh, poor guy I mean it was dark and there was nothing going on and he uh, he had his food bag in his in his tent and um, the rats chewed a hole in and at one point he said he had six or seven rats in there or mice rather mice and uh, he's trying to shoot them out of there so the uh, the uh, north the nor'easter accent came out it was hilarious he dropped some he dropped plenty of f-bombs every other word he was using it like a comma but uh, yeah. Funny, but not so funny, but uh, he has such a great attitude and uh, he packed up this morning and uh, everybody kind of get going So anyway, it was a funny jovial start to a Saturday morning. It uh, looks like it might rain on us a little bit But uh, that's okay. Can't rain on this parade. So we're uh, heading out and uh, catch up with you up the trail. Cheers Not sure if you'll be able to hear me or not, but uh, as you come up the blue blaze from the sign This is the uh, this is the ball at the top of the mountain As you come up here Amazing standing in the mountain. I just wanted to uh, shoot a quick video up here on standing in the mountain. If you uh, take the blue blaze, you get up to 5,495 feet. Completely worth it. Have an amazing panoramic picture from up here uh, and a memory. You know, you can't uh, you can't get enough memories. But uh, what an incredible morning! What an incredible start. The rain kind of subsided. Uh, there were great views from up here. Uh, and uh, first of all, I wanted to say thank you to my trail angels back in Tampa for making this possible. Why do I want to thank my trail angels back in Tampa? Is uh, they got up this morning to uh, go work. It's some fun, but it's to go work. Uh, they're picking strawberries for charity, which is incredible. And uh, I know Kaizen's also uh, promoting our company as well. It's all part of that uh, part of that community and part of that industry. And uh, this time next year, when uh, Plant City strawberries are in full full production mode, so will we. So uh, I just want to say thank you to them, and uh, thank you for the opportunity to be up here this morning. So with that, I am going to sign off, head back downhill, and uh, catch up with you a little bit later. Cheers. Teardrop said to me when I left top of Georgia, he said, you better tell me the truth. He said, I want to know if you shed a tear when you see the uh, Georgia-North Carolina border. He said, because it's an emotional, emotional moment. Teardrop, I shed my tear this morning. This is emotional. Part of the trail coming down off of uh, Standing Indian. It's really awesome. Walking through the uh, rhododendron forest. It's uh, going to be amazing come April and May when all these things bloom and there's leaves everywhere. This is going to be a pretty cool walk. Not that it's not a cool walk now. But uh, what a great trail coming down off the mountain. This turned out to be an amazing day. There are random ankle breakers scattered throughout the trail, but dogs are paying attention. Not too easy to, not too hard to miss. Easy to miss. I'm not sure what I'm saying. Uh, so I noticed lightheadedness at the top of the mountain. Probably why I can't figure out what I'm saying now. But uh. Yeah, definitely the higher I go, I notice that I have to get used to the uh, the oxygen thing. Living at sea level for so long, 
it uh, definitely makes a difference. I've heard some people mention it in their videos and, you know, getting in shape and I can tell based upon my breaths and everything and how efficient they are with the amount of air I'm taking in. But uh, huh, again, it's all part of the uh, getting in trail shape. Alrighty, continuing on. Cheers. So I was coming around this tree and I want you to get the first impression I've got. That's what I saw. That'll freeze you in your tracks. Very well placed leaf. <laughs> I got a close up picture of it from the tree back there. Awesome. Cheers. That would be the antithesis of a trail devil. Well done, whoever did that. Thank you. That's how you spell beach gap when there's no sand. Nice camp area, though. And yes, that is sun shining through the trees. Beautiful day. Hi, and you know what's really funny? You said you gave her something? Oh, so cute. Yeah, she's kind of going from uh, snack to snack. Yeah, and she wasn't interested, like, like oh. hungry. I, see, now she's... she's well, it's funny up. because the people that called gave her some food. Mm -hmm. We ran into some other people. And, uh... So, this is a delightful mountain stream right here. Nice little wading pool right there. Going for a little swim. You might throw a snack in there, I'd jump in there too. <laughs> Fantastic. Beautiful flow right here. What a beautiful day. Enough said. Real devils. Oh, I almost missed that jolly right here. Which is the Carter Creek Hostel tonight because it's a full house. I think there's, uh, let's see, probably close to 10, <laughs> 10 or 12 people here tonight. It's going to be a Saturday night social. I'll try to grab a video of everybody. We got uh, lots of vloggers here tonight. We got Bait Pulp Productions and Technomatic is there. And it should be a, should be a fun time. It's gonna rain like crazy tonight, so I think the party will be short. But anyway, this is the trek down to get water at the Carter Creek Hostel. <laughs> it's a uh, ways down there. I asked if I should have brought checking poles, and I didn't, but I think I should have. All right, more from the water. Here's the uh, bait bolt, like bait bolt productions duo right, right here. Right Animal laying the over there already on the uh, thing. We got Thor from, from Techno Nomadic. That's uh, uh, Norista. That's going on. We're going to change his name to the Pied Piper. <laughs> <laughs> got Choo Choo right here. Got Packers getting ready to set out. Yeah, she's already got her uh, condominium set up down there. That thing's awesome. Very cool. Tent City over here. We got uh, Finnegan Fast Freddy's over here somewhere. Got the tent up, pitched nice and tight. It's supposed to rain heavy tonight, so. Anyway, this is a, uh, a really, really nice, nice shelter. Nice view. It's amazing. There's actually two privies. So, uh, very cool. All right.